awesome. you, you better get out there and tour. You can sit around and watch movies and eat Ben and Jerry's when you're 40. But you need a tour right now. And we're like, yeah, 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 fucking hey, Jesus. And then 20 years later, we're just now taking his advice. Now that we're in our mid 40s. <laughs> Yeah, it's the first European tour. It feels feels awesome. We've had a great response and good crowds and seen a lot of, we've covered a lot of ground, so it's definitely been a lot of fun. France, Germany, Austria, through Italy, and then into Slovenia, so five countries. And, Yesterday, and, just yeah, driving here. Yeah. 16 hours or something. Yeah, it was a long day. <laughs> <laughs> We're washing our clothes in sinks and uh, showers. It's definitely a uh, return to the roots again for touring for yeah. a bunch of 45 year olds. <laughs> That's a good question. Yeah. Um, well, so in 2006, we were playing some shows and basically no one came to our shows. So we just decided it's it's tough to do this and we, we said let's just take a break and then one year became two became three became eight years and uh, we played a couple reunion shows up in Canada and then I was writing some some new songs and showed them to John and said should we try and do this again and I think for us the, the joy of it comes from just writing and creating the music together and then from there, I think we decided let's let's record it and do another album. So uh, the idea of going back and doing more music in this band means get in shape to play fast again because we want it to be as fast. No matter what we think we're doing, when we start off writing a song, we end up writing it as fast as speed is relative. So it's basically our one speed uh, that we write at. <laughs> Just doing laundry at my old apartment building and left my laundry basket there to bring my laundry home and went back and it, someone had stolen it so and then we just turned it into a song it was only half the length though and then Fletcher Draghi from Pennywise produced a record he said this is my favorite song it's too short so make it twice as long so we added the drum part in the middle and then kind of redid the chorus. We thought there might be a sequel to it the other day on this tour because he thought he lost his laundry basket again. <laughs> it sounded like a sequel was just about to be written, but he found it, sadly. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's great. I love it. I, I <laughs> Everything is fine. They're treating me very nicely. I don't know. It's an adventure. I've played with John a lot before in different different bands and yeah. things, but... Um, I knew he had what it took to play in Cigar. And Jason and he have great respect for each other, our original basis, so... It was perfect. We just had to drag him into this high-speed <laughs> race. Yeah, but so far, so good. So, with no budget, we decided to shoot it with my iPhone. A lot of our inspirations were from the 80s and the very early 90s. So to come back and make another music video, we just thought, how can we just look different or somehow appear different than a lot of the other stuff we're seeing out there? So we thought, why don't we just put wigs on and pretend it's the 70s? So that's what we did. <laughs> it was just a whole bunch of friends. We had about four hours that we borrowed a movie theater in my hometown, Grass Valley. And, um, yeah, we had, we had to be done by noon so they could start showing movies. So we, yeah, we just... We had to be out of there. It was very fast paced. I don't even know if the theater owners knew we were in there, but the manager let us slide in. <laughs> uh, we started the recording for a new record and um, we released two of those songs and we have uh, the rest written, so we're going back to record it right when we get back. And um, that's the next move. We have a tour in Japan coming up. Another video is about to come out. And the next one is a, is a, a song called We Used To that we're playing tonight. And it's, uh, it's kind of like the story of what we thought we were doing when we moved from Eugene, Oregon down to the the promise of uh, Southern California and 
you know, kind of like the epicenter of this real fast skate punk scene at the time. Our label was down there and it seemed like the best move. And then we got down there and uh, released a record and that was exciting. Good buzz was going and then Fletcher from Pennywise was like our big uncle uh, giving us noogies and headlocks and he said, you, you better get out there and tour. You can sit around and watch movies and eat Ben and Jerry's when you're 40. We need a tour right now. I'm like, yeah, 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 fucking hey, Jesus. And then 20 years later, we're just now taking his advice now that we're in our mid-40s. <laughs> but we're, we're having a good time. <laughs>